three-point lighting is mostly used when lighting a subject for an interview. It can also be used to light a subject in front of a green screen. As the name suggests, the setup is comprised of three lights. These are the key, fill and backlight. The key light is the brightest light in the setup and the main source of light within a shot. The light is usually placed about 45 degrees either side of the camera relative to the subject. The light is also angled down towards the subject to push any shadows downward. A key light by itself can create a very dramatic look. If the light is placed directly to the side of the subject, you can show conflict within a character. Placing the light above or below a subject can make the viewer feel unsettled or uneasy about the character. This is because unnatural shadows are formed on the face, which makes them look evil or sinister. The key light can be placed directly in front of the subject, but that gives a very boring and flat look. The light appears to fill in shadows caused by wrinkles, but will often make the subject's face look wider. The fill light is less powerful than the key light, and is used to fill in shadows created by the key. It should not, however, create a second shadow. The fill light should be the same colour temperature as the key and backlight. To avoid shadows, place the fill light further away from the subject, or add a diffuser to the light. If you want a softer light, you can use a reflector or a piece of white card. Using only the fill light creates a very dark and dramatic image. The backlight, or hair light, is used to separate the subject from the background and give the image depth. Having the light in short will create lens flare. This can look cool but is generally not wanted. You don't want the backlight to be too bright or you'll get light spill. To avoid this, use lights with barn doors or a diffuser. When used alone, the backlight can create a silhouette of the subject, making the facial features of the subject indistinguishable. This is useful if you want someone to stay anonymous in an interview.